you need to stop looking at daily PPC sales. You need to let PPC sales come through and be attributed because it takes some time for some sales to be attributed. So this video is for all the clients, all the small people who look at yesterday's sales and say, hey, why did our ACOS spike yesterday? My answer is always gonna be, don't look at yesterday. Don't look at the past seven days. Don't look at a, a three-day period that isn't over yet, okay? You always need to wait for attributed sales. So I'm gonna show you guys some really simple screenshots and show you that you really need to stop looking at daily sales, especially yesterday and last week. So extremely simple. I took, today is a Friday. I record these videos on Fridays, but I do a lot of my weekly reports on Mondays, as does everyone. They'll pull reports from Monday or Tuesday and look at last week's data, okay? This, this, taken, this was taken on a Monday. All right, you can see it was last week. It's, it's the week 10, 17 through 10, 23. On a Monday, when I took this data, I had eight, about 18,300 in sales at 37% ACOS. When I took the same exact screenshot on a Friday, same week, guys, 10, 10 17 to 10, 23, ACOS dropped by 3%. You need to wait and be patient with PPC. This is why I'm so against daily bid changes because people will say, oh, we had a bad day yesterday. Let's lower our bid. Oh, we had a bad weekend. Let's lower our bid. No, you always need to wait, okay? So this is really, really cool, right? Because you can see, if I can get both these on the screen here, these are the same days, right? And I have uh, the blue line is sales and the orange line is ACOS. This day in the middle, Sure, it, it wasn't our best day, but look how look how big this gap was the first day, and then look how much it made up in Friday because sales were attributed as they came in. Also, this one, right? Um, this ACOS dropped huge. It's probably dropped by like 5% because it was, way, it was spiked up here, right? ACOS was super high up here, and then it dropped down below. Wait, be patient. Don't change your bids every single day. Attribution is huge, especially um, as I'm gonna launch more videos with Amazon DSP. Amazon DSP, they don't make changes or even look at anything earlier than two weeks. Two weeks, okay? Stop looking at yesterday. Also, it makes your PPC managers crazy because if a client comes to me, and I know this at this point, a client says, hey, we had a high ACOS weekend. I, I'm not gonna be reactive to that because I know I need to wait for the data to come in. So I'm gonna say, yep, okay, it, was a, it might've been a slow weekend. We'll look at it in another few days. I'm not gonna go in there and jack down bids because we're just waiting for sales to come in. So I made another spread for, spreadsheet for you guys. I really wanna hammer this point across. Be patient, okay? Same exact account. I checked it on Monday, Monday on 1025. Everyone loves looking at yesterday's data, right? They love it. They see what happened with PPC yesterday. So on Sunday, we had $1,000 in spend and a 58% ACOS. Target ACOS is 30% here, okay? Again, the client goes to me, hey, what happened yesterday? You know, what are we gonna do? We should cut spending. I'm like, nope, be patient. If I looked at last seven days, this is, this is so dangerous in Amazon because it includes today. So if I'm looking at last seven days, this includes Monday, Sunday, Saturday. Monday isn't even over yet, right? It's not even over. But ACOS was already dropping, okay? ACOS was at 40%. If I looked at last week, this was the screenshot that I showed you guys, okay? This was the screenshot I showed you. The ACOS was 37%. Now, also, if I look at the 1st through the 20th, I had this amount in spend, this amount in sales, and an ACOS was 33%. Now, I checked on Friday, okay? Wanted to pull the same data on a Friday. Again, yesterday's numbers, way too high, way too high. If I look at the last seven days, still way too high for us. 
this is what I showed you because this hammers the point home that the clearest. And I want to show you guys that these two numbers in spend didn't change at all. Okay, this changed by a dollar. One more dollar came in and an extra 1700 in sales came in. Also, this was done on the 25th. I looked five days prior, my ACOS was still high. I waited another nine days, an extra $1,200 in sales came in and our ACOS dropped by another percent. And it was still nine days after. If I wait, wait the full two week attribution period, I guarantee these numbers are gonna change even slightly more, okay? So for PPC managers watching this, do not listen to everything your client says. You need to know this is happening and you can't be reactive. To clients watching this, please be easy on the PPC people, right? If you're hammering them every single day or every three days and they're making changes based on what you're saying, your numbers are not gonna get any better because you're not gonna get any better data, okay? So be patient. Look at the data. Know that people do not click on an ad and buy it instantly. People click on an ad, they put it in their cart, right? Then maybe they come back a few days later and they buy it, or they come back a few days later and they type in your brand name and they buy an ad from there, and that ad is still gonna get that sales attribution, okay? Please look at this, be patient, hope this helps.